Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Daisy. Thank you for watching. Um, today I'm going to film my eyebrow upkeep and how I wax my eyebrows at home. So, um, I'm going to be using the Microwavable Eyebrow Face and Lip Wax Kit by Sally Hansen. This is like $6 at Walmart. That's where I get mine, but it's Sally Hansen brand. So, I'm going to show you guys what it comes with. It comes with this wax in this container, okay? And um, this is what the wax looks like dry. And then you warm it up in the microwave. And you stir it with this stick. And the stick says ready on it. And it's, it's temperature um, related. So, if you stir, this, you stir it with this stick. And if your stick says ready it's cool enough to put on your face. If you can't read ready, then if the, you put the wax on, it's going to burn your face. So it's kind of a neat little thing that they offer there so that you don't burn yourself with wax. But this wax does cool very quickly, so you do have to work very quickly or um, don't expect to get all of it done in one sitting. Um, do one eyebrow and then warm it back up and do another eyebrow because it does cool very quickly. But um, yeah, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like and leave your comments, and follow me if you want to take chance in my Twitter polls and participate in which videos I'm filming next. Thanks, guys. Bye. Okay, so, take the stick that they give you in the kit, dip it in the wax, and run it where you don't, on the hair you don't want. Okay, see how I've applied that there? Now, Presley firm it. F Presley firm it? Are you kidding me right now? Firmly fucking press it to your eyebrow. And we're going to let it dry, so get some more wax and place more where you don't want hair. Sometimes I wax even if I don't get hair in some areas because I want it to look cleaner um, and I'm weird, so yeah. So you have to let it dry a little bit before you firmly press it, otherwise it'll just like stick to your hand, then firmly press it. Um, you might wave it for quite a bit. It's going to be pretty warm on your skin at first, but I promise it's nothing you can't handle. Um, it comes with an aftercare lotion to help with redness and things like that. Okay, so now... You pull your skin taut, and you're going to pull the wax in the opposite direction of hair growth in one swift movement. Well, try to make it one swift movement anyway. I'm not very good at it. Um, but hell, it keeps my eyebrows done. And then, like I said, always pull in the opposite direction of hair growth and pull skin taut. Okay, so then I got lots of hairs. I don't know if you guys can see that. But that's... Yay, score. <clears throat> that's what that is. Is a score. And then pull skin taut, grab wax, rip in the direction <clears throat> of hair growth. And I like the waxing method because I feel like it really cleans my brows up. And it even, I feel like it gets, you know, even the white hairs. Look, I got quite a bit there. I hope you guys can see that. Like, I hope it focused on camera for y'all to see that. And 
I really like the pointed end of this best um, because it's really less is more with this. It's really hard to apply if you apply a lot at a time. Okay, so I've applied some there. I'm going to apply some more. And it's it's really it's not it doesn't hurt. I don't think it's bad at all. I don't really think tweezing hurts that bad, but um, honestly, after a while, it can start to hurt because you just have to keep doing it and keep doing it over and over and over and over. As with the wax, you can just apply it in a couple times and it's painful but only for a little while um, and it's much cheaper five dollars to wax my eyebrows like there's so much wax in this thing you could wax your eyebrows forever so my wax is starting to get a little dry um, I've already partially done some of my eyebrows because I filmed the intro to this video a couple times and didn't like it so I don't really need to do that much to my eyebrows right now um any single time I sit in front of the mirror and I see my suggestion is to fill in your eyebrows exactly how you want them to look exactly with a ton of makeup so much makeup like and then get them exactly how you want and then Go and take tweezers or whatever it is that you need to do and or you know if you have someone that can thread for you or if you know someone that um, or if you get your eyes brows done regularly and you already have someone you can go to and ask them to do this for you then what I suggest is you do that and have them clean up the hairs that aren't filled in with the makeup where you applied it and then um, Every single time you sit in front of your mirror, every single time you wash your face, if you see that a hair has popped up out of the shape that you desire, pluck it immediately. That's what I do. Every single time I sit in front of, right now I'm just getting off the leftover wax, but every single time I sit in front of the mirror, if I see, I always have a really good pair of tweezers. If I see a hair I don't like, I'm going to take care of it right there so I don't have to worry about it. Like it's, boom, we're good. Like no worries and that's how I keep up with my eyebrows like I get them the exact shape I want them from someone else from a professional if necessary and then I keep up with them as best I can until I can until I lose the shape so right now I'm using the aftercare um, extra soothe lotion that comes in this kit um, it comes with all this it even comes with stencils um, if you want to do that, I don't like the stencils. I don't think any of them are pretty eyebrows at all. But um, if you were to choose to do that, you could. They're little stickers and you just put them on your eyebrows and then you wax the part that's outside of them. Um, so yeah, and you know, I also tint my eyebrows and I get them tinted, but if you guys would want a video on how to tint your eyebrows and everything, I actually ordered the product on Amazon. So, um, I would just do a whole nother video for eyebrow tinting because this is how I just keep up with my eyebrows. Um, eyebrow tinting is like a temporary dye that's supposed to last three to six weeks, but it only lasts about two weeks, maybe. Um, and it just makes your eyebrows, it just fills in like spots that you want to be there. I actually have a, it, them on right now, but it's it's very fair, but um, it makes my eyebrows look much 
fuller than they have ever been or ever are. That my eyebrows are the best they've ever been because I've been paying really close attention to them here lately with the whole brow trend and everything, but um, it's really not that hard to have brows and the tinting allows you to grow your brows out because then instead of taking away all the hair that to just match that one little spot that's nicked out of your eyebrow or whatever that you don't want to be there, you don't have to take away all that hair. You just fill in that spot. So your eyebrows essentially will get a lot thicker a lot quicker um, with the tinting process. I don't plan on like tinting them my entire life. I'm just doing them until I get my eyebrows to the fullness I want because it's awkward and hard to not fill them in every day and be in the middle of, you know, trying to grow your eyebrows out. So this is a way to like have your eyebrows always look on point um, even while you're transforming them into what you want to be, which we all know, ladies, is a very timely process. So once again, thank you guys so much for watching. I know I said it in my um, tutorial, or I'm sorry, not my tutorial. I know I said it in my intro video that please subscribe and like this video, but please subscribe and like this video and follow me on Twitter to participate in my polls. I just want you guys to be very active. Um, you already are, don't get me wrong. I love it, but I want to give you guys what you want. So I want to hear from you. Um, so thanks so much for watching. I, got, I will see you on my next video, whatever that happens to be. And I appreciate you all so much. Bye.